Christmas time again, Paul. Can you believe it? No, I can't. It seems to come round quicker and quicker every year. And I'm delighted that it has because I just love the sounds. We've got the music in the background and there are smells as well. And I can see a bar behind us. I think it might be time to try the local uh, Glucken. I don't really know what we might be getting, but um, well, there's only one way to find out, I suppose. What do you think? You know what? This looks much better than the ones that I got at South Bank last year. And it, just to prove that we are actually in Bruges, as if you can't tell from the, uh, the background, <laughs> uh, it says on the glass as well. It's the Brugge Christmas Market. So cheers. Cheers, Marcus. You know what? I think it does taste so much better here. Shall I have a little smell? Mmm, it actually smells okay. And the taste is all right, you think? Yeah, I think that it tastes better for some reason. It's not going to send your eyes to the back of your head, is it? No, I think that the one that I had last year had this kick to it and it was kind of like too much cinnamon or too much spice that made it unpalatable. But this one is just nice. Well, I think maybe they know what they're doing here. I don't know. <laughs> I think I might have to try it too. But we're not buying another one. We're going to share. Because Christmas time is all about caring and sharing, isn't is it, Paul? I think so. How's it tasting? Never mind the taste. The warmth is just what I need on a really cold and look, day like this. It is a glass. Yeah, it is glass. Should we keep it? Uh, well, we, we get our two euro back, so uh, we're not going to keep it. You can't, <laughs> can you keep it? If you don't return it, then you oh, can keep it. Okay, but it's going to be dirty, so I think we'll return it. <laughs> okay, here we go. Mm. It's all right. It's not as strong as you say as the one that we got at South Bank. I think the one that we had last year, it had the like, uh, kick in the back of your throat. The one thing I would say is, is that if you smell it, even though the smell on its own isn't that strong, but if you smell it when you drink it, it adds to the sensation, which is a little bit overwhelming for me. So I am going to hold my breath. I'm going to take a deep breath like this. And then I am going to drink it without breathing. So I'm about to do that again, because I've used all my breath to speak now. But I think one between us is probably about right. I think so. Yeah. But it is very warming. I think because of the glass. And look, Brugge Christmas Market. You want to finish it? Okay. As they say in France, merci. This is Belgium, my dear. But they say merci here as well. I'll let you off. <laughs> I am steaming up, my dear. Mmm. I think that the ones in Europe taste so much better for some reason. So that's why we do these annual Christmas markets to try all these different modes of wine. Look how popular it is. I think everyone behind you are actually trying it right now.
Should I say what she said to me? What did she say? She said, do you want a refill? <laughs> <laughs> no, one is enough. It is. As nice as it was. Well, now we've had our drink. Now, as we're in Belgium, we need to try something local. And I think that has to be waffles, doesn't it? Definitely. At any time of year. And at the Christmas market, there are so many different types of food and drink that I think waffles are definitely going to be on the menu. I definitely think um, so. I hope so. Otherwise, we'll have to scratch this piece. So <laughs> let's have a look and see. So we are on the hunt for waffles. Um, do you know? I saw one before, but actually. Did you? But do, do you know what waffles are? A batter. No, they're waffly versatile. <laughs> I didn't actually make that up. What does that know. mean? I think that's bird's eye. <laughs> All right. I think I found it. It's where the queue is. Ah. Do you know which one you want, though? Uh, milk chocolate for me. Are we just getting the one? No, we'll get one each, I think. Really? Yeah. Well, it is Christmas, is it not? It is. And I will have marshmallows. Marshmallows? Yeah. What? Yeah. It says marshmallows there. I don't know what I want. They're not that big. I think we should have one each. All right. What? Are you running out of money already? I don't know what I want. Maybe I'll... Smarties? Only Smarties are the answer. I don't know. See, I know all the ad phrases here. Sprinkles, Smarties, marshmallows, chocolate shavings, coconut or chocolate pearls, uh, also hazelnut. Hazelnut. Could I have um, milk chocolate with marshmallows? And then the second one I will have Dark chocolate and hazelnuts? Yeah. Yeah, sorry. I didn't know what I want. That's why I was like thinking. I'm thinking too hard. <laughs> it should just be instinct, I guess. Thank you. I don't think I've, I've ever had it like this. That's why it seemed a bit different. <laughs> no, it looks very good. Still crisp. Here you go. It's 10 euros. Thank you. Bye. It looks divine. All right, let's try these waffles. Oh, God. This... It's sprinkling on you. As long as the chocolate's not dripping. Look at that. Look at that. Marshmallows. Mm. Oh, oh wow. wow. Oh, that chocolate's divine. It's Belgian chocolate. Mm. It's very rich. It is. Oh, and we're going to stick a, the stick down my throat as well. <laughs> okay, this is difficult. Uh. Mm. This is very... No, this is quite indulgent, I think, mm -hmm. but it is... It, it, it definitely hits the spot. Mm. Look, all the little bits of uh, marshmallow as well. Okay, it's breaking. Oh, oh no. Luckily it landed in the box, not the floor. Mm. It's raining as well. That's the wonder. That's the wonder. I'm under, I'm under a tree. No, this. <laughs> it's a bit of rain. Oh, well, it's quite heavy. Oh my god. That was quite bad. Mm. Well, I think I've nearly finished it. What's your verdict? Oh my god, it's fabulous. The chocolate's divine. It is. I think that's probably the best milk chocolate I've ever had. Yeah, definitely it is. I think you find a stall that you like the look of. Yes. Um. So I don't know whether you've seen them before, but like they are like these 
Santa Claus type of ornaments and they are kind of um decorative. Oh yes, these ones. Yes, they're very intricate. What are they called? They do have a name. There's a mouse as well. Santa Claus? No, they're not Santa. No. No. They're no gnomes. Ah, they're a type of gnome. Ah. Right. I didn't know that. Look, there's mini gnomes as well. The mini gnomes? Like, oh, yeah. Do you remember we saw them make it on the, on this program once? Yeah. So maybe you need to get one for our tree. What do you think? I don't think I want, like, a big one. The little one would hang on the tree. I don't want the acorn. This isn't an acorn. Okay. Uh, do we have something like this? Yeah, right. That's a moose, I think. Do you want one of these ones? Yeah. Oh, this one's nice. Which one do you want? They're all different. This one or the one with the red? The one with the red, I think. This particular red one? Or any? Yeah. This one good enough? Yeah, this one. Okay, just this one. Five euro. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Thank Thank you. you. Bye. If you are thinking of coming to the Christmas market in Bruges, it is very easy to find. It's right in the center of town in the market square.